I just did a session on hypermobility and tried to get everybody up and doing things. I had uh, people stabbing each other with pens and throwing tennis balls and drew on people. Uh, basically, I was just trying to share ideas of getting people to understand certain variables that you need to control good movement patterns that are practical for dancers in the studio. the health practitioners are talking with the choreographers and the students so there's a dialogue that's crossing all of it so we can find a common language where we can really talk to each other it's not two separate languages. Dance sector's biggest strength is all the passion because nobody's in it for making loads of money everybody's just really passionate about it and I think that is the thing people do really want to improve things they might lose their um, belief that it's going to change, but people are passionate, really are. I think the future of the dancer's health will be a slow process. Um, I think that things are changing. I do think it's slower than I would like. But in the time that I train to where things are now, there's better provision for people. There's still room for improvement. And yet again, I think it's just about people joining together and enjoying everybody's differences so actually rather than working with people that think the same actually working with people that think differently so that we're always constantly challenging our thoughts and our perceptions and our having our, what we believe our beliefs and ethos is challenged the whole time so we either reaffirm them or we change them that's what i think